And this week, Russell on business in the new economy. Why is simple so complicated? Doesn't seem like everything's complicated in today's world. True. I think what has happened is technology has created so much freedom for us to do so many different things all at once that we've just overcomplicated our lives. I'm finding out that buyers are more interested in having something done very simply. Oh yeah, for sure. I talked to a CEO and one of my clients and I said, how many products and services do you offer? He stopped for a minute, paused, he said, I think around 60. I said, let's count them. 77 products and services that he offered. I said, how in the world do your employees remember all of those? He said, they don't. <laughs> He's got a problem. He's got a problem. How can they sell all the products and services if they don't even remember what they are, let alone all the benefits and the features and convincing the customers that they believe in what they're selling? You know, there is uh, this world of the Internet we live in, and there's so much information out there that we have taken simple and made it very complicated. It, it, it's, it's, there's so much flow of information, a lot of it misinformation, some of oh, it yeah. disinformation. Right. And so what we've got to do is we've got to find the, the, the way to touch our customers and do it in a very simple process. Malcolm Gladwell talked about in his book, Blink, how people make decisions very quickly. It's just the, the blink of the eye. Sure. And, and I find out that most salespeople have forgotten that and they're trying to oversell, give too much information to where the buyer has pretty much made the decision to move forward until the salesperson has pretty much talked them out of it by all the complications. You need to look at this information. What about these options? Next thing you know, they're saying, it's not simple anymore. I need to step away. And once they step away, you lose that customer. I call it we live in a soundbite world. We do live in a soundbite world, and what's happening is, is people are looking for, tell me now, but they don't want this whole rest of the story that it was ignored. How many times have we looked at documents and looked for the asterisk, looked for the small print, looked for the, the jargon or lingo that we don't understand, that we, we distrust right off the bat? Exactly. The last time you bought a weed eater and pulled out the instruction book, and you said, my God, what am I going to do with this? <laughs> All it needs to say is insert gas, pull handle, go. Exactly. <laughs> so simple is easier to understand and trust. As I said in the show previously, people have, their default setting is distrust. They're looking for simplicity to make it easy to be understood, to trust the people they're buying from, and that is how you make it happen in the new economy.